welcome back to the brain mission channel i'm your host brainy and today we're gonna take a dive into the cbt the science cbt for 2024 let's see how we would have done if we had taken it so there are 40 items on this test each has only one correct answer read each item carefully select the correct response then shade the correct corresponding letter of the answer you choose on the answer sheet provided number one which activity is harmful to the environment terracing organic farming slash and burn is what i choose right here the images below were taken from a poster carefully examine the images and use them to answer item two so use both sides of the paper fix dripping pipes plant a tree i chose conserve the environment that's what i think would be the best um, name for the poster uh, which is a factor that can cause climate change i chose releasing large amounts of carbon dioxide in the air over time so that would be deep all right so here i am for this we're gonna look at two um two different years for on a landmass so it says land no ice so no ice around and then you have more ice over here so it says which is likely which is the likely cause for the change that occurred um i would say global warming if let me see more frequent change of global i say global temperature because it would melt the ice around so you have more land and ice all right the diagram below shows an incorrect order of the organs in the digestive system study it carefully then use it as item five so mouth stomach oophagus that's oophagus then the small intestine large intestine something is wrong here I think from the mouth, the oesophagus would be second. So I would say the stomach and the oesophagus should be replaced. Oesophagus here, stomach over here, and that makes more sense. So I choose A. Um, number six, use the diagram below to answer item six. It says, what is the name of the organ labeled X? This is definitely the lung, right? Right. So, which is a property of sound? It travels in one direction from its source? That's not true. And how would you hear behind when I'm talking and you're behind me? It travels faster in the air than in solid? Uh, no, I don't think so. It travels in the direction from its source, in all directions from its source. I say that's it. All directions from its source. Speech affected the color? No. Uh, read the statement below then use it to answer item 8. When the machine is turned on, it makes a loud and high pitched sound. Which word best describes the sound that the machine makes when it's turned on? I say, it's not rhythmic, that's not music. Unpleasant definitely makes an unpleasant sound. All right. Um, which is an example of a non-luminous object? All right. L objects that actually, I would say, reflect or can bring its own light. I'm sorry. So car headlights has its own lights. Cell has its own light. Bicycle reflector actually is a reflector so it's not it's definitely that one there you go so i would say bicycle reflector the diagram below shows what happens to a light ray as it makes contact with no with i'm sorry an object use the diagram to answer uh, item 10. so here's the object here's a light ray so the light hits the object and it doesn't go through the object so which is true about the object is it shiny if it was shiny to bounce Opaque would be it because opaque means density, so it can't go through it. Translucent means some light will go through it, and transparent means that it can go through it. So I'll choose opaque. Um, examine the diagram below, then use it to answer item 11. Light ray striking the reflective surface. Light ray bouncing off the reflective surface, which is a likely characteristic of the reflective surface. The reflective surface is uneven, curved, rough. I say it's smooth. That's why it's bouncing off, reflecting. Which is true about a type of material, with all types of material. They can exist as solid, liquid, or gas. I say that's it. They are transparent or translucent. Not all. Right, so definitely that's E. Which is a characteristic of an, of an irreversible change. The dash substance undergoes a change in state. Well, it doesn't mean it can't change back. Mass of the substance increases. Doesn't mean that it can't get to, it can't lower the mass. Substance changes color. You can repaint it or change the color again. 
Substance cannot return to its original form, so it's D. Um, read the observation below, then use it to answer 14. When warm air was blown onto the surface of a mirror, water droplets were formed. That sounds like condensation to me, like how it rains. All right. Um, the label below is from a common household product. Examine the label, then use it to answer item 15. All right, so inhaling spray may harmful, extremely flammable container may explode if eaten. So I know all of these, right? So which, what advice would you offer to a person using the product? Avoid storing in cold areas? No, avoid using. All of these are flammable stuff. I would say avoid storage in hot areas. So that would be C, just to jump to it. Uh, which pair of words is needed to correctly complete the sentence below? Matter will change from liquid to a that's through a process from liquid to solid through a process called freezing so that's a read a statement below then use it to answer item 17 a student wanted to clean up a spill without getting any liquid on his hand so i would say they need to use something that is waterproof as like a waterproof glove so the water liquid doesn't touch the hands the diagram below show four rods of equal length made from different materials. Each rod was heated at one end using a lit candle. The time taken for the other end of the rod X to get hot was noted. Use information to answer 18. So this is time taken for location X 45 seconds. That must be metal, right? Time taken for location X the glass it takes 75 seconds um, longer. So Time taken for the location X is the wood, 120 seconds, and this is 100, so this will take longer. So I would choose uh, wood. All right, which diagram likely represents an irreversible change? So square or uh, rectangle to rectangle, this can change back. This is from a square to a circle, so I definitely think this is it. And finally, which statement best describes mixtures? uh they contain one type of no they cannot be physically separated that's not true there's form but the solid dissolves no they contain two or more different substances i say d so that's it from me guys let me know how you did as well or how i did as well remember to like share and subscribe and i'll see you in the next video